I'm Bear Grylls. I'm going to show you what it takes to get out alive to some of the most dangerous places on Earth. I've got to make it through a week of challenges in the sort of places you wouldn't last a day without the right survival skills. Uh, today's episode, or should I say tonight's episode, is a very special one. Um, it's actually a night episode, so it's 10 o'clock at night here and um, it's pitch black and I'm just using a head torch that I brought from home to, to find my way around here and a really good way of navigating during the night is to use the stars. So uh, what I've got, what I'm looking at here is the Southern Cross and the, the North Star and those two constellations are, are really useful for finding the South bearing. What you do is um, you intersect both those constellations with a, an imaginary line and wherever those two lines interse in, intersect uh, you draw a line straight down to the horizon and that's your south bearing so uh, that way south and what we're going to go is east which is civilization and that's uh, that way so let's get hiking it's actually really eerie and actually quite scary out here and um, you're kind of walking into the unknown here and and your, your mind's playing tricks on you, you, you keep seeing things or hearing weird noises and I actually um, feel really uneasy. Um, what the special forces taught me is to always think of happy thoughts whenever you're in doubt. Um, so that's what I'm really trying to focus on at the moment because to be honest, I'm actually really freaked out with darkness all um, around me. My next priority is to find a good campsite to set up a little little shelter and um, maybe some snares. So let's get looking. All right, I've been building my shelter now for two hours. I found a good campsite and just got the last stick to go on. There we go. He's a bit of a tour. There we go, there's the inside sun. Our next survival priority is to, to build some stairs, find me some breakfast in the morning, so let's get snare making. We've got a dead weight, which is our rock, and a stick that's holding it up, and there's a, a stick lever just there. So, um... What I'm, what I'm hoping is going to happen is a critter comes along the game trail and skips along and then he knocks this this stick over and he gets his hand caught under the rock like so ah. so that definitely hurt me and so hopefully it's going to hurt them and trap them and I'll hopefully have some possum or some sort of marsupial I've for got breakfast a bit of Bit of shut eye at the moment, and it's actually quite cold now. So, hopefully, we'll get some sleep. Oh gosh, that's my trip wire. Come on, we've got to get out of here. Go, go, go! Could have been anything, but I'm not taking any chances. <sighs> Gotta get as far away as I can. <sighs> Alright, I think I've gotten some distance from that bear and a campsite now and that really well still is but that really had my I'm heart going really thirsty my mouth's really dry and I'm gonna have to resort to the most extreme of water fluids because there's uh, none I can find around here so I'm actually gonna have to drink my own urine
All right. Um, oh, still warm. But um, let's see how we go. Oh, oh, that's so salty. It's All right, keep the rest for later and oh. All right, it's pretty much first light now and I've actually been really lucky to come across this in the wild. It's a really rare occasion and what I found is is a house. So this most definitely is my ticket out of here. Let's go.